walk into middle school, and welcome to Friday. I'm your host, Farzad Ferdos. Today's catching up day, as we've had quite a few segments piling up, but we're working through them. Now let's start off by spending a minute with HMS student, Spencer. Three of my friends are Jack Petruni, Callum Greenwood, and Miss Sloan. I am involved in... Do we play sports? Uh, no. <laughs> well, chess. Um, the most favorite school project I've worked on is art class. Uh, right now, my passion in life is drawing. Um, if I could change one thing, I would, in the school, I would change, make all the water fountains have root beer in them. Yeah. Something I am good at is, are we good at anything? Yeah, I'm not good at anything. Um, something, uh, and I like doing it because uh, something meaningful that something someone has done for me is. Uh, no. Give me a uh, look note for Valentine's Day. Valentine's Valentine's Day. We have a bonus interview that was too long to include on our show, so visit our website and scroll down to see a minute with Carly and Brooke. Next up, we have our favorite, Mr. Rockwood, with Fun Fact Friday. Today I'm going to talk about Homer's The Odyssey. In particular, one point where Odysseus and his crew were stuck on the island of Aeolia. Well, the king of Aeolia, who was thought to be a minor god, but in, the, in this version he is known as a human, he appears to Odysseus gives Odysseus and his crew an ox skin bag with three unfavorable winds with strict instructions not to open the bag. He was also given, Odysseus and his crew were given a bag with one favorable wind, which they used to help propel the ship off the island out into the open ocean. Well, while they were out at sea, one member of the crew opened up the bag of unfavorable winds, which caused the ship to be uh, sent back towards the island of Aeolia. Well, out of that, today we have what's known as Aeolian harps. They are uh, musical instruments that are, uh, sounds come from them strictly from the wind. They're placed in open windows, the wind comes across the strings, and musical notes are created. Speaking of sailors, why does it take sailors so long to learn the alphabet? Think about that. And in the meantime, make it a great day, enjoy your education, and be kind to one another. Thank you, Mr. Rockwood. Now we have another in our series called Hello, Hopkinton Middle School. These are quick clips from high school students with what we have to look forward to. High school is an awesome time. It's fun. It's relaxed. It's chill. It's a time for you to recreate yourself. If you didn't like who you were in middle school, you can create new friends, change your friend group, and the teachers are super nice. High school is great. Really fun time. Just be whoever you want to be and have fun. All right, and now let's have a minute with the teacher. For today, we interviewed Mr. Paquette. I first became a teacher because I wanted to help students with uh, math. Favorite part of teaching is definitely grading tests and quizzes and going through homework. It's fantastic. Um, <clears throat> but seriously, uh, my favorite part of teaching is just getting to know the kids. So my students have taught me a lot. My first couple years teaching, I just remember being so focused on the curriculum, uh, making sure we're getting through everything. And um, as I progressed through teaching, started to see that there's a lot more to education than just learning your math facts, learning your concepts, learning your algorithms. I have a couple of pets. I have a cat named Penelope. I have a dog, Bluebell, that we just got a couple of months ago. And I have a fish named Flo. Hobbies, I like to exercise, I like to work out, I like to golf, um, I spend a ton of time with my family. If I could add one thing to this school, it would be Starbucks. Thanks for taking the time with us, Mr. Paquette. Coming up next, let's try a brand new segment, which we're calling, What's in Your Locker? Okay, uh, better luck next time, I guess. Let's move along to question of the day. Today, we're asking, what makes you happy? Of course, family, friends, and Fridays. Food watching Paw Patrol and celebrating Mrs. Daniel's 75th year of teaching here. 2K MT Central. Friends. Dinosaur-shaped chicken nuggets. Hearts of Iron 4. 
My friends, family, and dog. My really fat dog. Grey's Anatomy. Money. Starbucks. Elias Pereira. Mamba out. Playing my Xbox 360. Nice soy latte with the beans on the side. <clears throat> Gossip Girl. Hanging, Hanging out, out with, with our friends. friends. Pokemon Go. Memes of the dank variety. Sleeping in. Sports. Playing video games. Ice cream. Ice cream. <laughs> awesome. Thanks for your answers. And now it's time for the birthday scroll. Happy birthday to... And finally, we bring you Have You Seen This? Here's today's image. You have until next Wednesday to find it and send us an email. That's a wrap for this episode. Check us out online for our videos and email us at hmstv at hillers.org. And boy, have we been getting some compliments. Send us yours and then join us next week for our very first HMSTV Appreciation Day. On behalf of everyone here, study hard out there. What? I can't do it if I see the red light and you're going to fight. Do something funny. Thanks for taking... Oh, how did I mess up on that? Out online for... Oh, man. The thing went too fast. One here. Study out. Study. The last line! Oh, we have to do it again. That's the best part.